Oh my gosh, I feel like I work at Disneyland. Good morning, my beautiful and lovely friends. Ow. Look at little baby's bottom. Anyway, today I'm doing an edit. I'm editing Skylar's videos now. But right now, first thing, I'm going to go for a coffee walk. I get my 10,000 steps in right away. I'll walk for 5,000 steps and then walk back. And I always feel pretty darn good afterwards. So let's check out the view. So this week I've been living at this park. It's pretty nice. It's right by the bike path. And it's walking distance to coffee in the morning. videos for him today so have a little bit of work to do it's been fun reconnecting with him haven't seen him in a really long time but we are still very good friends and it's really really nice to see him and i'm actually gonna hang out with the kiddos in a little bit but yeah this is my day real exciting stuff guys i know all right it's the next day i did a bunch of laundry i went swimming with quintuplets i lost an eyelash it was a scene. It's so fun to see them. I missed the kids so much and it's been fun to hang out with them. And I'm actually gonna clean my trailer because I wanna come in and see it and play the piano. So yeah, I've been hanging out and reconnecting with my ex-boyfriend who is now just my really, 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 really good friend. I'm so excited because I finally got everything in the mail for Influence of the Musical episode three. And I wanted to just say thank you to Linda, Jennifer, Jan, Bella, and mark with a c for your one-time venmo donations because of you guys i'm able to make episode three of influence of the musical so i'll be recording that for the next several weeks i will be posting one new vlog every week and i'm very grateful for today's sponsor timu they sent me a bunch of stuff um, that i can use in my influence of the musical episodes actually um southern bell is in here right now and i can't wait to see how the outfit fits Woo. Now Timu is going to be really fun for me personally because they have all sorts of props and wigs and just anything you could possibly need. Toys, electronics, they have all sorts of stuff at budget friendly prices and they have a 70% off sale on their website. There's a link down in the description. Um, I'll also put it in the comments so you can easily find it. Just download the app. Download the Timu app to get a $100 bundle. Once you download the app, you open it and then you can search DKA. 4996 which is my personalized code and it will take you right to my shopping carts i'll also link all of these products down below if you're interested in them specifically but let's pop it open and see what we have i hardly remember what i ordered so one thing i will say about timu is it took a while to get my items i actually had two separate packages one of them came really fast and then there's something in here that took a couple weeks longer so just keep that in mind that you need to be patient when receiving your order i just want you guys to know what to expect when you order through timu so i want to make sure that i point that out i got a couple wigs here so i'm gonna try them on look how pretty this color is in person it's a little more like orangey like a light ginger color one thing i've learned while doing this project is i would not be a cute bald person it's not a good look. I think your face has to be really symmetrical for the bald thing to work. And it just goes on like so. Yes, yes. I have a couple of new characters and I'm not sure which wig I'm using. So this will be fun to kind of figure it out today. Sometimes I'll like side part it and swoop the bangs if they're like going into my eyeballs. I really, really like this one. The quality is good. It's nice and soft. It's got the hook in the back underneath so you can make it nice and tight. It looks cute. I dig it. I dig it a lot. So you might see, you might see her in one of the videos or you might see her on one of my bad hair days. I don't know. Here's another like grayish blonde. Oh yeah, this one's supposed to part in the middle, I remember from the picture. The little bang swoops. Come on, bang swoops. 
that's cute i like it i love um wigs and i love hats because it takes me like 49 seconds to get ready bad hair day no problem no problem that's the thing with wigs though most of my hats don't fit over the wigs but again the quality is decent it looks pretty much like the picture but yeah i like it I like it. And you know, these wigs have been sitting in a plastic bag for a little bit, so you kind of have to finagle them. Give them a little love. I like it. It makes me want to cut my own bangs. Seriously though, having wigs has kept me from cutting my hair because I always get bored and then just snip my hair off and then regret it. Love it. That's Keeper. I really like this one. All right, let's see what else we have. Do I dare show you? I don't want to give away the full episode, but I have a character named Deliverance. And where's this hat? Ironically, of course. A little bit of shedding with this wig, I'm not gonna lie. For the price and for my purposes for doing my fun, silly little videos, it's perfect. So I'm not too worried about having like a human hair um, wig that's gonna last me that I'm gonna wear every day. I got these really cute glasses. This is for a character named Hariana Grande. She's the beauty influencer and she does everyone's hair and we do a little makeover thing, you'll see. She's got red nails and I think I might remove the lenses because they reflect, but those are super cute. Oh, what in the Mary Poppins is happening here? Southern Belle may or may not have a little umbrella. It's almost like a doll sized umbrella. It's little. It's perfect for my purposes for Southern Belle. So speaking of Southern Belle, I think I see her dress. Southern Belle is lavender color and doing color theory with all of my videos. And the reason I've been in St. George is because my storage unit is here so I can film stuff and then I can put stuff in storage if I need to. It's been really, really handy. Oh my gosh. I don't know. Is this a Southern Belle dress? I hope this fits. I'm gonna try it on. Oh my gosh. Now that I'm seeing it on, I don't know if this is Southern Belle or if it's gonna be for another character, but I feel like I'm getting ready for work at Disneyland. It's total princess dress, super fun. I also got a petticoat to put under it, so it'll be like huge and poofy and hilarious. I love physical humor and I love the juxtaposition of like wearing this out in the wild. Yeah, I don't know if this is Southern Belle. We'll see, we'll see, that's the thing. I wish I had a costume design. I have a lot of different characters planned and then I order stuff and sometimes things look how I would think they will and sometimes they don't but like I just wish I had a costume designer to help me out with all this stuff. It'd make it so much easier but that's why I'm excited about Timu is because it's really budget friendly and I'll be able to order basically anything I need for props and outfits. They have such a huge selection like for example um, my next episode's called Awkward Tea Party. So just little things like this, like a little crumpet to grab a, or ice cubes or sugar cubes, something like that. Just little props to make the scene look cute, but not have to spend a million dollars doing my own props and stuff. I got a captain hat. There's a scene where I have someone driving the Suburban, one of the characters. So captain hat goes there. I don't know, does this umbrella go with this dress? I think it's funny. Once I get the Southern Belle wig on, which I'm not gonna show you until I post the video, but. Now originally Southern Belle was gonna be all lavender, but I found a different wig for her that I think I'm going to like better. I love all the crazy colors. I'm doing color blocking, but I don't know if like, this is a lot of lavender. We'll see, I don't know, but I really like this wig. Oh, I just probably wouldn't wear it with this dress. And then here is the final wig that I got. I got a little bubble machine for Airhead. She's always just off in her own world. Here's the petticoat. It's gonna go under this gigantic dress and just make it look huge and ridiculous. And I think it'll be hilarious. Oh, it's hot in here. Filming these episodes in the summer season is gonna be quite interesting. These wigs are quite hot. Okay, the thing I'm maybe the most excited about so as of episode one and two, they are all in their funeral clothes, like the main characters are. Um, so Gossip is actually, her color theory is this like, this kind of green color. So she now has a black bow right here, but they're gonna change into their regular clothes and get out of their funeral clothes. So that's a cute little bow. Like it's a pretty hair bow. I'm using it for costume stuff, but how cute is this little hair bow? I'm gonna use it for 
lots of different things, but I love this color. And then I have a character called Reality. Her name is Reality TV, and she's Irish. And this is her wig. It's like a greenish olive color. So looking forward to this character too. I'm getting so excited to film. I'm so happy to have all of my props. Speaking of, there is also a marriage that happens in one of the later episodes. And Timu has all of this costume jewelry. This is like a pink ring. So they have all sorts of stuff. And now I can no longer walk through my vehicle. It's so funny when people glamorize this lifestyle. Like if you glamorize it, if you think it's fun, I triple dog dare you you to live in your walk-in closet for one week with no running water. And you'll see precisely how fun it is. Let's see, I'll show you two of the other pairs of glasses. Yes, these are fun. This will be a fun character. I love getting all my props because it inspires new characters. So those will be fun. I think these will be Southern Bells glasses. We'll see, we'll see how it all comes together. Are those fun? So for me, Timu is perfect for what I'm doing for my projects, but they have all sorts of different stuff. Like whatever you want, you can pretty much find on Timu. So check it out. Okay, and the thing I am the most excited for is this is part of it. Like I said, the next episode is called Awkward Tea Party. So I have this little tea set. Here's this little teacups. There's six of them. It comes with six little matching plates, some little teaspoons, and last but not least, a little teapot. So truly, you can find anything you need on Timu. This will go in the Awkward Tea Party box. I'm so excited to start episode number three. So thank you so much to the people who have sent me a one-time donation and thank you to Timu for sponsoring this video. Also, I finished bejazzling my base. So this will be coming up in a new episode as well. We're getting there. And just so you know, if any of your items don't work, you get free returns for up to 90 days and it's free shipping on Timu items. So just so you know, I'm going to decide which of these work and which of them don't and I'll have 90 days to return the rest. Again, links for all these specific items are down below. I might have to let the Quints play with the bubble gun later. Like I mentioned, I'm going to show them the trailer, so I'm just going to get cleaned up. Oh, two other things I got my other package. I got these cute little fuzzy hair ties, like literally anything you could need. I was trying to design my Hariana Grande character and she's all red and I might use this filter on her. I think it would be totally fun to use this filter when I'm doing Hariana Grande. She's the beauty influencer in the group. So we'll see how this goes. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> this one is fun. I really, really like it. Not with this outfit. It's a little clashy, clashy, but I'm learning. I think I have a very short forehead because if I put the bangs where they're supposed to be, it's like way up high. So I always have to do the side swoop bangs. When I ordered this one, it looked like they were like straight across bangs, but it's all good. We can swoop it, but how cute. This is also a Southern Belle option. It's this little hair clip with Victorian age curls could be fun for Southern Belle. We'll see. We'll see what happens. I'll keep you posted. I also found a snake necklace for one of my characters. Seriously, anything you're looking for, you can find it on Timu. It's so fresh and so clean. Actually, Skylar has never been inside my she shed, which is crazy, but I'm gonna show him tonight as well. Just inside for a little AC. The kids are coming back in school soon, so. I'll be off camera, but um, I'm helping Skylar move into his new place um, in the next couple of days. So he has some extra hands moving. I get some AC. It's a win-win. It's a great situation. It's 83 degrees out there and it's always about 10 degrees warmer in the trailer, which is nice in the winter because if it's like 35 outside, it's like 45 while I'm sleeping. But I haven't flexed my vlog muscles in a while. I'm going to be doing some traveling and some hikes and stuff soon. So I'll be vlogging that, but this week I'm just hanging out with friends. Does anyone else feel like they're just stepping into a new chapter right now? I, I don't know. I'm just feeling an overall sense of like, ah, peace. I'm really enjoying it. I don't know. I think it's because I got my packages in the mail and I'm really excited about this project. Hello! Hi! Hello loves. So um, I just hung out with 
kids and with Skylar and that was my day is probably a pretty short vlog. I'm excited to get back into the routine of it and excited for some more like hiking and traveling adventures. So those will be coming up soon. If you made it this far in the video, write Timu down in the comments below. Again, everything is linked that I showed you in the video today and discounts and codes and all of that good stuff will be linked below. So thank you Timu for sponsoring this video. I'm so excited to get filming on the new episode. So we'll see you guys soon. It'll be about a month before I have that finished, but stay tuned.